All right, what's up, everyone? It is uh, the captain <laughs> here uh, from Alter Reality Games. And who do we have here? Uh, Tim Cox. And what did you do this weekend and why? <laughs> uh, I lost in the top 16 because I'm dumb. <laughs> What did you do? I didn't write Heat Leo on my deck list, oh, so I got a game no. loss. <laughs> right. You didn't need it. It's fine. Yeah, you it also won the 1k, right? I did. Oh, that's good. Let's take a look at your deck. Cool. Uh, so, standard, free debug, free gazelle, free proxy. I guess this is like less standard, but I play too spinny. So, like, free of this is just objectively terrible to open with. Like, by itself, it sucks. Foxy is, like, kind of a starter because it can get you into this. And your hands without this are, like, unplayable. So he's just trying to maximize this, and this just like, this is terrible in multiples and just not necessary. So two is the correct number, in my opinion. Uh, for the one of Silent Grace, it's this one, the Jaguar, the Falco, and the Foul. Uh, Foul's like insane, and most people don't play it. But it's like an extender, but it also locks back row. So like, I think so many matchups, it's just like, it's just cleanly game, like in the mirror, it makes them activate raw, so you can just OTK them. Also, like, you can chain block Gazelle, so, like, you can have Gazelle be chain like one and the summon of this be chain like two, and it's just, like, nice. You're good. And also, in the extract, it helps with the uh, FTK in the mirror match, which is just making Baguska. Because the they, FTK? Yeah, you make Baguska and they can't beat it. Alright. It's great. <laughs> uh, then, free Reclusia. I don't know if this is super old, but I know, uh, like, ARG EU, which was Raph and uh, Luke. Uh, played this at Atlanta. I think we all, yeah, we all played at Atlanta. But like, uh, this guy's just insane. Being there can only be one. Potentially being Goliath and stuff like that is just really important. Also, it's level three extender. It's a fire. Like, it just it's just super high value against cards like like the floodgates because like meaning twin tw like I tried meaning twin twisters for the longest time and it's just terrible against Thunder Dragon. Just like you like make your matchup significantly worse. But this is just like. You can get to the stallion, and it's just like way better. But it's also like a way to clear everything generically. I suck at deck profiles. <laughs> uh, free Phantasmi, free Ash, free Vela, two Ogre. Uh, these I think are standard. I played this over in permanence because you can draw it off this, and this is a thing that you can make things zero with with the uh, Helio. An Ogre. So like every Sky Striker player ever is like the greediest people. They just make like all their cards into Moira and you ogre them and they lose. Uh, also like Crow is just like not good against Thunder Dragon, so you have to play for that. This is like better against the Azapod deck. And like in the mirror, it's weirdly okay. If you get to go like you open with this and they summon debug and you ogre them, no one plays Mir. So it's just game. Like it skips their turn. And then you just kid. Uh, I, know, I play this again. I maybe would play free, but the deck's like super tight for space because it's already 40 and I think the deck is basically perfect. Uh, spells, free circle, two will, sanctuary, fusion of fire. Uh, so these are like the Salmon Grey spells, which I think is probably all of them. Uh, I don't play super poly because I just don't think it's necessary. It's just like not searchable. You only need to play one of this in the main because you resolve it and you win. Uh, this is obvious. This is like insane. I don't play free because drawing mobiles of anything sucks, so I play two and a rebound because this is better in the mirror. Because in the mirror, like, say you like summon Gazelle or Debug, or like, say you summon Debug actually, and it gets negated, you rebound your opponent's Gazelle and then you just kill them. <laughs> so, like, this is super good. I guess, like, Sky Striker taking Ray and stuff is okay too. Uh, yeah. This is obviously just Rover. Like, they free cool by. It's, it's like the best spell card. And one trap card, one roll. Rage is terrible going second. Like, Rage is unplayable going second. You just cannot win if you draw Rage going second. So, like, unless you're against, like, the slower decks, like, uh, Guru and stuff. But this is, like, an obvious one. Also, the problem with Rage is, like, unless you hard draw it, you're never sending it. Because if you send it, it's just super obvious you have this, and it's, just, like, worse. So it's just better to, like, make a rank 4 with this, and then it's just, like, way stronger. Uh, so, yeah, it's 40 card main. Uh, extra deck. Three wall, three bailings, uh, two heat Leo. They're in it this time. Uh, Stallion, Violet Camara. Only one of this is necessary to be honest. Like you can recycle it. Like two comes up sometimes, but not enough to warrant the space. Uh, Heater, Phoenix, Borrow Load. Uh, this is like randomly necessary because sometimes it's just really hard to deal with pick monsters. Like if you can't get access to the fusion and stuff, and like the Sky Striker Mirror is nice. 
<laughs> uh, and he is just like insane. I would play two here if there was space, but there just isn't. Like sometimes it's really good to just make this and then pass. Because like if they kill it, you get into the gazelle. So if your hand sucks, you can fix the hand with this and just like protect yourself with the hand traps and you're good. Uh, then Dweller for like, uh, I make this one blind because it's the most generically okay one. It sucks against Sky and it sucks against, it's like okay against Sky, but it's terrible against Guru, but that's fine. And this is for the FTK in the mirror. Uh, you go first in the mirror and you make Bagusko and they just can't win. They have to have a Kaiju. It's just unwinnable for them. So that's always nice. It's like better than Sanctum because it's in the extract. Uh, side deck, three Pankratops. I would play 15 of this if I could. This guy's great. Uh, free Lancia for the Thunder and the Orcus deck. Uh, free Twin for like Sky, Guru and stuff. Uh, I'll do this one's last because that one's nice. Uh, Super Poly and Fusion of Fire. I side these for the mirror going second. Just because like Rush OTK is nice. I like you, some cards in the mirror are just like unplayable. Like the Roar is just terrible going fast, so there's just no need for it. Uh, one Rage just because you want this against like Guru and Draco. And then, like, really good for me this weekend was Free Book of Eclipse. Like, this guy was insane. Uh, I played against a couple of dinosaur decks and just, like, swifted it. Like, just putting the Conductor and stuff face down. Like, Thunder Dragons, obviously, as well, because a lot of them have caught uh, the Hot Red for Crystal Wing. So this just, like, clears the Goliath play, and then you're, like... Obviously, it's, like, pretty hard to kill five monsters or whatever it is, but it means you can play, which is just better than nothing. Like, it's good enough going first in the mirror, because, like, they summon, like, Debug or something in your Book of Eclipse, and they have to pass, like... Again, it's like kind of like a Sanctum. Well, obviously it can be Ash, so it's like underwhelming sometimes, but definitely recommend it. Yeah, uh, so that's the deck. Uh, I think it's perfect, but I mean, I'm sure it will change at some point. <laughs> uh, shout out to Max, Jeff, uh, Luke Parks, and Raphael Naven for like building the deck with me and stuff. Uh, shout out to ARG. Uh, I'm gonna try and remember the sponsors now, because I'm <laughs> new and I'm not good at this. Uh, shout out to Arjun Saga, Monster, Circuit Series, ARG Custom, Aphidian. Aphidian. Am I missing any? Did you say Monster? Yeah, I said Monster. I think that's it. Think that's it, yeah. Cool. Uh, okay. Right, cool. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.